Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It is hump day. We are halfway through this week. It is already the 20th of this month. Um, May is just flying by for us. We had another town hall meeting yesterday. So if you haven't seen that, it's on the Facebook live page um, and I'll send it out in this video. Uh, sorry, I'll send it out tomorrow night. Um, as well, along with um, our plans for MRF and how you can take part in our Memorial Day, sorry, not MRF, our plans for Memorial Day um, and how you can take part in our Memorial Day Memory Board Challenge. So those details will come out um, tomorrow night for you, as well as that link to the town hall meeting. Um, we didn't share a ton of new information, did answer some questions that some people have had, and really the big thing is just kind of waiting a little bit longer to see what the government says. Um, next week, Tuesday, I'm really hoping to have some kind of information um, that is new for you guys. Hopefully we have an answer from the government as to what we're allowed to do as a gym. Uh, we are in phase one. We haven't entered phase one, but gyms are in phase one. So when we enter phase one, gyms get to open up um, and we'll have some restrictions for sure. We're already preparing and we're so excited to see you guys. So make sure you continue following along as well as getting after those mental health podcasts. I know we're getting towards the end of everything or what we feel like is the end, but if we're at all concerned about what it looks like to go back into the world or come out of our cocoons, I think it's helpful to um, be thinking about our positive thoughts, our feelings, and how to get connected with our body um, and really have a positive experience going back into the world. Um, again, it's, it's not a matter of pretending like this doesn't exist, but finding ways to be advocates for ourselves and take care of ourselves, be healthy, um, stay healthy, and recognize that most people don't actually get the virus and most people don't actually die from the virus. So just kind of highlighting those thoughts for ourselves rather than the negative ones that we see in the news that really scare us. So if you haven't been playing along with the mental health stuff, do so. If you haven't been following along with our emails, make sure you start because we will be giving you guys new information and guidelines and we really are gonna do everything we can to open in a safe, amazing way. So those are the things going on. For our question today, it's nice and silly for you guys. Um, you get to pick between two different categories of animals. One, would you prefer horses, cows, and llamas? Or elephant, lem elephants, lemurs, and giraffes? Um, I think for myself, oh, it's a hard call because of the llamas and the horses. You can probably do more with the horses than the llamas. But something about like a lemur sounds super cute. So I think I'd be in the lemur category um, along with the elephants. They can be scary, but they're a beautiful creature. Um, I learned that they're scary in Africa. Nobody else really thinks the elephants are scary, but they are. Um, <laughs> if you're too close to them, if you invade their lives, they can be. But uh, those would be my choices. Elephants at a distance, lemurs because they're adorable, and giraffes because, I mean, they have a long neck and I definitely don't have any of the height that they have. So envious maybe. For our warm up today, I'm going to show those movements. We've got 20 seconds of um, nine different movements. So that's three minutes. You're going to do it two times through. Just going through those 20 seconds to get that body good and warm, stay moving, have some fun. Then we have a nice quick pre wad, just 20 seconds of some core work for six total minutes or four rounds. There's 30 seconds of rest. So it's performed as one minute straight through of core work to get that core burning. Um, and then our wad today is six squats apart. So we have three burpees, six squats, three burpees, doing that every minute on the minute for 30 total minutes. Um, it's a pass fail type of workout. Sorry, pass, no pass. I don't like the word fail. Um, you should always learn when you don't pass something or when something doesn't go your way. Um, so pass, no pass workout. Um, the goal being that you're able to get through all those rounds. So if you have to scale back those reps or scale back the movement, do so. So really quick, we're just gonna go over those warm-up movements and the core stuff, um, show you what the movements are for that workout. Shouldn't be a ton of novel stuff. The warm-up, I have some new movements in there just to get you guys um, thinking about other ways we can warm up that body. So we got 20 seconds, we all know what a jumping jack is. Let's do 20 seconds of jumping jacks. After those 20 seconds of jumping jacks, we have air squats, sending those hips down and back. 20 seconds of high knees, 
you can also just march in place if that's too loud for um, your apartment or whatever you're in. Um, after those high knees, we'll go right-sided Spider-Man. So just bringing that like forward, twisting up, right side only. You can drop that back leg if you prefer to. And you'll switch sides, heel down, twist towards that front knee. You go 20 seconds there. After both sides are done there, we're gonna go into some forward and backward army curls. So for that forward army curl, I'm just gonna adjust the angle of the camera here. You're gonna be in a plank position, but on your forearms, and you're gonna cross those forearms toward each other. You're gonna army curl forward for 20 seconds. If you run out of space, that's fine. Just go into that army curl backwards as soon as you run out of space. And then just do forward and backwards for 40 total seconds. But if you have the room, you'll go 20 seconds straight forward, 20 seconds straight back. If you don't have the room, you'll go 20 seconds. I'm sorry, 40 seconds total of as many forward as many back. So you're going to try to stay moving for 40 total seconds, either 20 forward, 20 back. But like I said, 40 going forward and backward. If that's too challenging, you'll scale up by doing in a plank position, walking. It's not going to get those shoulders quite the same, but works as well to keep you warmed up. Then we're going to go into penguins. So laying on the ground, feet towards the heel, or sorry, heels towards the butt. Reach for those heels. Chest should be up, chin should be tucked. Once we get through those, we've got scorpion twists laying on our back. So you're gonna lay on your back, opposite hand to opposite foot, twisting through there. Those look super attractive. <laughs> so 20 seconds of those. You can go long leg, or you can bend that leg and do that twist in that way if you want. Then you'll go right back to your jumping jacks get through all that for a second round. So that is your warm up. For our pre-wad, those movements we have are flutter kicks, butt ups, and windshield wipers. So for those flutter kicks, you're gonna try to bring that chin again off the ground, roll that chest, bring those feet off, and then flutter. If that's too challenging, you can relax that upper half and flutter, but make sure you're still pushing those uh, the low back into the ground so your feet might be up a little higher when you do it this way. Whereas here in that hollow position, we want to try to stay about three to six inches from the ground. So those are your options there. If that's too challenging, you can do bicycles instead. So 20 seconds of flutter kicks. From there, we're going to go into those butt ups. So you're going to go full butt ups, here, which means your feet are going to start up straight up. To the ceiling. Push that floor away if you need to. And then a skill for this would be um, to lay, lift your legs and just do this half, pushing into the ground, not coming out and through. So those are your two options there. And then that last one being windshield wipers. These ones are the challenge here. I think anyway, you're gonna be on the ground. You go from one side up and over to the other for 20 seconds. Again, always try to lift that chest so that your low back is in the ground. You can do this with your head down for a little bit of an easier movement. And then your other option would be to bend those knees and just do the windshield lifters here. Try to get that good twist. Then you rest for 30 seconds, get after all those movements again for four total rounds. That is your pre walk for our wad, we are six squats apart. So three burpees, six squats, three burpees. Doing that every single minute for 30 total minutes or basically doing 30 rounds of that. So if you're doing it on minute one, you're gonna do your three burpees, your six squats, your three burpees. Let's say that takes you 30 seconds. You're resting until the end of that minute and then you're starting that three burpees again on minute two. So one, make sure you're getting some rest in there. Burpee options. We know them all, but we'll show them anyway. You can lay down, pop up. That's the RX version. Some scale options. You can step back, lay down, step up. If you don't want to lay on the ground, you can step back, pop up, and up. 
We do want you guys practicing laying to the ground if you can, though. That'd be great. Um, so practicing different ways to get down and up. Or that squat, scaling option, no weight, just doing a regular squat for six. If you do not have full range of motion, you can't get that full depth, I want you guys to grab a chair or a couch, sit, and get up. That's going to be better than doing this because this isn't practicing much for your squat. So if you can normally sit to a chair, if you sit down at home, then sit and stand for your six. Option as well is to grab a um, dumbbell and then ideally we're going six with a weight today. That's the RX version. Then um, we've got three more burpees to finish it off, which I just showed you. Should be pretty straightforward, but if you have questions, definitely don't um, hesitate to ask us. We are here to answer them. Have fun.